Cooling Water. Everybody know that song from Mr. Lee Williams. I'm Timothy Fleming Sr., the pastor of Mount Carmel Baptist Church. I'm sure most of you have heard the sad news about the passing of one of the greatest gospel singer and quartet group in America. Singing is the language of the soul. There's something about music that you can't always describe. And this person that I'm speaking of, Mr. Lee Williams. Mr. Lee Williams came to our church several times and performed here at Mount Carmel Baptist Church. And when I first heard him, I sat in the audience. I wanted to know what everybody was so excited over this man. I was sitting in the pulpit, never will forget it. And I leaned over to one of the announcers. I said, boy, he's act like he's not doing nothing. He's just singing so still, no movement. And that guy leaned over, I'll never will forget it, Mr. Callaway passed on. He said, Reverend, just sit there. I said, sit there, just wait. And I kept sitting. After a while, this guy began to start so slow. And he kept moving. Then I started looking. He kept going a little high. And before I knew it, <laughs> People were running all over the place, and I was standing up about to take off too. This is the great Lee Williams, one and only, that was never one like him. Down through the years, we have hosted a lot of programs here. But that night, he really shocked me with cooling water and several others. Never would move, but just stand there. I saw a preacher like that once, would never move, but he could just rock a church to pieces. He was a man, had movements without move. What you think about that? He didn't move, but had movements in his voice. Oh, we're going to miss. We've lost another great one, Joe Lagarde. Now we have lost Lee Williams, but he's up in heaven singing cooling water. He's up there where the water flow that's chilly and cooling water, but by the river of life, where there's a tree of life, singing. I'm sure when we get to heaven, we're gonna hear him singing, cooling water. I want us to pay respect to this great legendary singer. With all due respect, he deserved whatever we can say good about this man, and he held up until the end. He didn't switch over, he didn't change, he kept up with gospel music, and he didn't try to imitate nobody else. He was himself. And there's one thing you can't do. You can't beat me from being me. When you are yourself, can't nobody imitate that but you. God bless you, and I hope that we'll remember him in history. And I always said, I think God allowed the black man to come to America to redeem the world with his music. Who else can sing like us? Lee Williams and his group are a good example of something God put within the black race that nobody can really describe, and that's his music. God bless you, Lee Williams. Rest in peace. In a world of sin, but grace and mercy, it took me in.